Hi, I'm Karthik from Fisherman Training Institute Salala. I welcome you all for this session. In this session, I'm going to teach you how to create a browser in Microsoft Publisher 2002. Once again, I repeat the topic: how to create a browser in Microsoft Publisher 2002. So, to open Microsoft Publisher 2010, you just click on the icon. When you click on the icon. It will take you to the backstage view. The enter view is called as a backstage view. In this, just visit most popular and click browsers. When you click browsers, it will takes you to the install templates. There are plenty of install template where you can make use of these templates in order to save your time. Instead of creating a new template, creating new design. you can use the existing templates and we can able to customize it as we need or as per our requirement and there are two types of templates or there are so informational and price list so first we'll see informational you just select the template you like so i'm going to select this just a single click now you can able to see the template right here now is the time for customization you can able to customize the colors color schema as you need or as per your requirement and then font you can use the existing font list or you can choose from existing font list or else you can create a new one how just go to end create new you just click create new where you want to specify heading font and body font and then you want to assign a name for it and save it now i'm going to use my custom font called my font and then business information if you want a new one you are allowed to create a new one or else you can use the existing one so to create a new one you just click create new where it will takes you to create new business information set screen but you want to give the individual name and job position or title organization name address phone fax and email address and then if you have any business motivation you want to give right here on business logo and at last you want to give a name as a customization name and save it So now I'm going to use my car. Okay. So options: the page size is a three pan or four pan. You can able to see there are three pans: one, two, three, and four pan. There are four: one, two, three, four. So I'm going to use three pan and uh, include customer address. And in case of form, there are three types of form: namely, order form, response form, sign up form. You just select none and create. When you click create, the corresponding template will be loaded into the UI, where you can able to find the info information. Now we are we want to customize it as per the requirement. Okay, so first I'm going to increase the font size. Uh, maybe sixteen. Okay, so so these are called these two tabs are called contextual tabs. So I'm going to use format. It's a drawing tools format and text box format. So I'm going to give some colors. Uh, let's say this color. So now I want to change the color. I'm going for more color. Okay, and I'm going to select. color and just make it bold okay now try to increase the font size and try to move it and next so product or service information so uh, i'm going for international conference Okay. 
so once again I'm going to format it I'm going to give some color and shape full maybe I'm going for more color okay and then I'm going to make this bold home bold and then I'm going to change the shape so I'm going for format and make it for center alignment okay now I want to change this to my logo so just click right click go to change picture and try to locate the picture and insert it so now you can able to customize the image as you require So here is a business motto you want to give. So I'm going to type my motto. So educational invest uh, innovate us. So make it bold, and if you want to change the font color. Yes, can able to change it. And if you want to format it, you can able to uh, give the colors as you like. So I'm going for alignment. Now we can able to edit the phone number. First, I'm going to make it bigger by increasing the phone size. Now I'm going to change the phone number. Okay. Next. So I'm going to format this. I'm going to increase the size. So go to home and make it bigger. Okay, first you select all the things and make it bigger. Okay. Bold. So now I'm going for formatting. I'm going to give some color format. So I want to make this center alignment. Okay. Now select this go to home try to increase the font size make it bold and if you want to give any address right here you can able to give or else just leave as it is and then here comes your uh, so back panel heading if you want to give anything any information about your headings back panel headings for example a boat fisherman institute so boulder let us see of 16 so no props you can extend it I want to format this so make it center and I want to change the shape and then fill color and make sure I fix okay 
and then if you want to give any information about this okay i want to change the foreground color font color also okay and if you want to provide any information about about this yes you can provide i'm going to provide some information to increase the font size and you are allowed to change the logo so i'm going to insert clip art to insert the image and if you want you can able to give the border or as you like okay so now we are moving for the second page page 2 so main ending so it's going to be i'm going to type about about conference so i'm going to make it as bold and try to increase the font size and for text box format make it a center and drawing tool format i'm going to give some color and try to change the shape Okay. So now if you want to provide any information about the conference for example uh it's okay so just i'm going to increase the font size home so let us say international conference on cloud computing and its applications and you can able to format it If you want to give some colors, yes. And if you want to change the pictures, yes. You can insert the pictures. And secondary heading, let us say. program program agenda so i am going to make this font bigger and bold and i am going to have a different color for this and here try to have the program agenda like uh, location before that i want to increase the size let us say venu and then let us say so welcome speech 
and then about campus likewise you can design as you like and if anything about salala so if you want to have a registration form you can have the name uh name address college name and email and mobile here yeah, go so this is how we can able to listen as per your requirement so here try to increase the font size and make it bold and format try to give some colors so now i try to increase the size make it to 18 and go to format and make it center alignment and this address okay so now you can able to design it you guys can able to know how to design a brochure an information brochure it's quite easy it's all depends on your creativity how you look and how you format it and if you want to save this go to file and save us and give a name and save it or else if you want to save and send there is option save and send you can use this option like uh, using email email preview change file type create on pdf or xps document you can publish as html or else you can send a current page send all page send as attachment send as pdf max pdf okay or else save us you can have a pdf or xpdf document xps document or plain text you can use anything by default it will be a publisher file so now i am going to save so my work next one save it and if you want to view this go to file go to print where you can able to see the print preview so first page and second page and you can just if you have any further doubts you can contact me through my email kartik.me.vlr@gmail.com or just log into my blog spot that is www.kr3ik.blogspot.in i think you may enjoy this video thanks for watching this video